Oh, no, I see you on Instagram. No, no, no. My, my, my Facebook account is over packed because a few of my friends... Hold on here. a second. I'm talking. A few oh. of my friends got, like, deleted from my from my Facebook, and I never deleted them. It's so weird. Hmm. So you got to re add it on Facebook. Yeah. I'm like, what's yeah. that? Like, why would, why would somebody hack my account and delete my family off of, off of Facebook? Like, it doesn't make any sense. I definitely, I would say I... Cat eyes, like like um, almond shaped eyes. Hey, you know what I thought I saw yesterday when I was in the woods? I was like taking pictures. I swear to God, I saw this like black shape. I saw this like black shape, and it looked like it was staring at me, and I got it on video. It looked like a black cloud. Yeah, it looked like a black cloud or something. Might be the thing that screams in the woods at night. It goes, oh, oh, that's a Christmas that's tree a, right there. Sounds like a fucking fox. There are foxes around Fox, here. Foxes are, well, scare the fucking piss out of you in the woods at night. Really? Fuck yeah. You have a fucking of, YouTube a fucking fox screaming. Do you have a lot of animals okay. near you, Jeff? Uh, yeah, but like weird shit. We got like lots of javelina, which are like, they look like little pigs. Yeah. But they're, uh, they're actually closely related to hippos. Really? Yeah. They are? Yeah, they're, they're in the peck pecko peckery family. You do that the peckery family. Yeah, I've heard that. Yeah, so, uh, javelinas, we have a shit ton of coyotes. I've shot coyotes, I, like walking with the dogs, like coyotes coming after my girl dog ones. Uh, Are you allowed to shoot them? Oh yeah, yeah, I, yeah if, like if you're in fear of you or like your family or personal property, yeah, absolutely. Uh, oh, but you can sure also, I, you can go coyote hunting. Uh, 363 days a year, from my base. by state law, they can't have the season open all year, so they have two days off. Let's put that on my nose for a second. July 1st and 2nd. Do they really call the problem? Uh, they, uh, like on, we have like the Nextdoor app is like pretty popular in Arizona by us. Yeah. And they'll be like, like during uh, the fall, yeah, there'll be people almost crying once a week within a two mile of them. They're like, oh, I got my dog. Oh, I got my dog. Oh, I got my dog. no. I got my dog. And some people are like, still have three dogs. My other dog got eaten by a coyote. Like, fuck, you're at least leaving your dog outside. You're just feeding the fucking coyotes. Hey, do you guys see those hawks up there? Yep. I haven't seen hawks in such a long time. The first one didn't show up on camera just now when I was recording it. I've never seen a chase of vulture in my life in this game. express a feeling via me. Via me, yeah. And it's killing fucking the kids. It's, you know, it's, it, it, it started off fun, but we didn't know what it was going to turn into. Yeah, it, you know? um, it's just like... You ever see the teams memes? Yeah. The really she, awesome. Oh, yeah, she's into all that. It, well, the, and the worst part is all the fucking, the memes are stupid as fuck that the kids send, because they don't even make any sense. The meme has nothing to do with the text. <laughs> and it's like all these like, chaotic fucking memes that don't make any sense, and it'll just be like... And she showed, was like laughing and showing us this one in the car yesterday. It's like, 
when you're when you're at a sleepover and uh, the mom tells everyone to go to bed, and it's a bunch of like it's like an AI generated picture of like cats at speedboats racing through the water. I'm like, what, what? the fuck does this have to do with anything to do with? It's like, is that the mom or is that the kids going to bed? It makes no sense. <laughs> Some pictures don't make sense. Yeah, but like that's all this shit. It's like, and it'll just be like, it'll be like. Well, yeah, it's funnier because it's open to your own interpretation. I'm like, no, that's dumb. I want my joke to match. Yes. <laughs> like, I'm, it, it, uh, if that makes me old fashioned, then so be it. I like my memes. Back in my day, my memes match. <laughs> Back in my, you you remember the old the old meme from back in the day? It was like uh, every time you masturbate, God kills a kitten, and oh, it was yeah, like yeah. it was like those two like little brown like fucking. Well, they I never heard that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they're, they're like little brown furry monsters that look like like a fudgesicle with their mouth yeah, open, yeah, and they're like, like yeah, ah. Little, like it was a little cartoon brown. Yeah, and it's like please think of the kittens. Yeah. I just remember seeing that it was one of the first memes I ever saw. Yeah, stop, stop masturbating, God's watching. <laughs> I, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. This one. This one. They're hanging here. Yep. Yay. That's funny. I wasn't going to share any more beyond that. I, like, I never, I never would have had sex and I never would have um, masturbated ever in my life if I would have known what I know now. Why is there somebody that's, is there somebody that's masturbating in this house? Having sex with, uh, with, with, with cabin fever. Cabin fever. Call himself Dan. Dan Rubens on Nicky Folio. Yes, master. Yes, master. Yes. <laughs> you know, I woke up yes, this morning. Yes, I woke up this morning and all these pine cones were on the ground. Uh, all fell off all day. Oh, they're gifts from the forest. Was it fucking windy or something? I just don't know where the fuck they came from because there's no, there's no, I was actually looking on the tree. There's no green pine cones. And now they like, they just magically appeared. Gifts from the Deadwood Forest. The pants are on me. I do see some in the tree, like laying here though. Yeah, they come off of this tree usually though. That's weird that they're, they came from this tree. Yeah, they haven't opened up yet. Yeah. Yeah. Usually they're they're brown by the time they hit the ground. Yeah. Yeah, they haven't seeded out. Can I get you something else to drink, Josh? For you. Do you wanna do you want an orange pop? I got a bottle of orange pop. There you go. Oh fuck it, I'll take one for the road. Alright. Go back, two hour drive, gotta let the dogs out and my our fucking fat cat caught his first mouse. We have apparently a mouse in our laundry room. Oh wow. And uh the first time he's ever caught anything. Uh, well, he's caught shit. But, like, was he walking around like? Burr, burr. No, we, I, I, we, we missed him. Like during the night, I was like, somebody answered, like came to the door at like eight. We were still kind of sleeping. Fucking, I said bye, whatever, and then I turn and my, like, that's a weird looking toy mouse. And then I was like, huh, that's not a toy mouse. So I was like, uh, checked out. And I was like, oh, that's a soggy ass cat mouse. Oh god. And. Uh, <laughs> I had seen him down the laundry room acting weird. He was like, just like sitting like an Egyptian, you know, like by, yeah, by the toilet. And he was like staring under a cabinet. I'm like, what is your deal? Like, I'm like, oh, he was already. And I found like two mouse turds under there. I'm like, yeah. hey, he's fucking hunting. And yeah, sure as shit, fucking two days later, find a fucking mouse laid up there. I wish I could have seen him carry it around. I don't know why cats. Yeah, yeah they make the noise. Super they, cute there, too. They go, burr, burr. stupid little mouse hanging out of their mouth. Yeah. They're really proud of themselves. Uh, like, look, I, look what I did. When Raven and Bjorn used to catch mice, like, they, they'd know that I'd, I'd catch it. So they'd play with them, like, you know, they just, like, kind of, and they wouldn't kill them. And then I would put them in a little thing and take them outside. But they knew, you know, they just oh, were, ha they were like happy to catch it. It's like, you know, the thrill of the hunt for them, you know? Yeah. It was, I miss Raven so much. I didn't finish what I was saying about um, uh, uh, jo Josephine, uh, her account. Uh, uh, I'll talk. Well, you know, open it for him? I mean, it's not twist off. No, it's a twist off. 
Well, even if so, I'm a man, I, I got that. Yeah, you don't need somebody. You got something with it. I have a, I have a key in my pocket or something. Yeah. yeah. Stick lighter. I miss Rock and Ryan. Did you see Tom at all when you were here? Or? Uh, oh, uh, no, I have not. I I tried to meet up with him last year. Didn't work out either. I haven't seen him that, since I've been up here the last two years at all, actually. Uh, I think the last time I saw him was when Grandma died. We stayed over there. Oh, really? Yeah. So it's been a, I think that's when I was there last. Yeah, I think it was when Grandma died. It was the last time I seen him. Dr. Chris, five years ago already. Uh, a little bit. His, uh, he got, like, married, like, I want to say like, three years ago. Yeah. Like, like nobody knew about it. he's like kind of like secretive about it and then she died suddenly like six months ago oh. and and he but he was like weird about it and like the whole situation is weird i don't understand tom got married she no oh, chris. chris oh chris, chris? Yeah, yeah, yeah 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 tom's son chris how do you take it back oh uh, um yeah so that, that was a weird deal he was living in south oh, carolina okay. wasn't he mm-hmm wow yep, yep. that's weird yep um yeah he's kind of like yeah I, the whole thing's weird his mom was weird he grew up weird like she was like a weird like kleptomaniac like my dad told me stories like when they like when they first got married and came back from their honeymoon uh they were all living together and like she stole like some of like the jewelry they just bought in like hawaii like together and like and then like a weird like they had like a fucking she was like wearing their clothes and shit what? and then like uh when we were first in arizona uh my parents had sent chris like a graduation gift it was just like money in an envelope and she fucking stole it and then he was like like she like stole it from him you know she's like fucking crazy yeah why would she just say something she, she, she died of cancer a few years ago oh. yeah, yeah and she was like, i did three four or five years ago Angie was her name? Yeah. My friend Angie Picker died. Uh, I still don't know how exactly. She was found dead in the bathtub. I think she, I think she, uh, You got something. Oh, I, I thought you had like a piece of pine cone under your nose. Oh, I might have been sniffing it. <laughs> I love the smell of it. You probably have pine sap on your I do. I gotta go use that butter. butter yeah, 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 my fucking neighbor is from Yeah, if you get pine sap on your neighbor, you get the skin right off. Really? Yeah, just oh, take, wonder... take a fucking stick of butter, cut a piece off, and just wash your hands with butter. Olive oil would work. I wonder if it comes and gets it off a of couch, too. I have pine sap at certain times of the year all over my car. Well, I've got a really garage so I can park my car in the garage. Yeah, now we've got to get new siding on the wall, get it painted, new roof. Okay, hold on. It's terrible. It's literally fucking. Oh, I've got to trim all these. Well, at least Jim said he'll. I've got to fix this door or put a new door on here. New windows. Oh, I can't I'm believe it. I'm new windows and a new front door and our bedroom. Not all the windows, but like four, four of them, I think. But one of them is a fucking bay window, like a projected bay window, that I know it's going to be a like absolute money pit of a fucking window. It's like, it's probably a three, four thousand dollar fucking window, I bet. Fucking stupid. I know, it's like everything. And everything is so expensive, yeah. It's like everything doubled. What is a fucking roll of blue painter's tape? It was like literally double what it was like four years ago. It's insane. Like, I've been finding rolls of painter's tape all around the house. I'm, I'm not sure how, how to utilize okay. that. Well, we'll save it all. It's expensive now. Yeah. When they were working upstairs, they probably had a lot of painting junk. Yeah, it'll take money off your bill and give you your partial rolls. <laughs> well, so you would have what else can painter's tape? Oh, my God. Besides the paint. That's right. I've got to get this done. Uh, it's just handy for me, like marking boxes and stuff. Like, we have like, storage totes to use as like, labels, labels, temporary labels. Yeah, good idea. Peels off it. What? It looks really ratty. Yeah, your face, your face up the, is fucked up. It's, it's really it's rotten rough. away. The gutter's probably leaking. Yeah, they are. Let me. Oh, wow. That one's not as bad as that one up there. 
I mean, basically, they could replace just that board for now, but I, I need everything done. Yeah, that one might be savable if they pull the gyre off and scrape it, sand it, and paint it kind of thing. Make, um, like I made this really amazing tea out of out of these things. It was almost like a tea color. Like, these things have done. One good thing about where we live, there's a, all there's awesome like farmer stands like out in the fucking country. Oh yeah, you can just get like like just little random vegetables and stuff. I love that. Yeah, like they'll just, just like, have like pull up and it's like it's just an honor system. It's a wooden box and you just like have a price list. You just put money in the box and take whatever you want and leave. Oh wow, yeah, just, like, that's cool. Is that fucking gas station? That's how life should be, man. You can pay and pay inside. You can pay inside. You can just. It's, it's like in yeah, clerks. You, you can yeah. just drive off if you want. Yeah, please leave appropriate change because yeah, people like, trust it, one it, another. Literally, you, you can walk inside. You don't have to pre oh. yeah, yeah, I was, I was blown away. I, and I went in. I, I had to fill up two cars in one day. And I, I, we were, I was when we were going to that drop of the kids off to go to Minneapolis. And I, I filled up my truck. And I filled up the Jeep. And like, like she told me about it. I was like, oh, well, that's cool. And I, and I forgot. And I'm just so used to prepaying. I went and did, I did again. And yeah. I was like, she's like, you forget you can, you don't need to prepay. And I was like, oh, fuck. It. Right, I'm going to go enjoy it. Thank you. I went outside and did it. I, I love it cool. when you don't have to prepay some, per but everywhere now yeah. you, you do. But it's nice. I use a lot up. of cash and it's like, it's really convenient for that because it's like, you don't have to go in twice then because they get to go in, pay with cash, go outside, pump, and then you probably have change. Yeah. Then go and get your fucking change. It's a pain in the ass. Yeah. So. Um, yeah, I tried to grow some apple trees uh, from seed. I grew uh, nine of them out of 10 seeds that I planted. Got about this high. I planted them outside. Within two days, they were dead. And, no, they were they were on the deck. And uh, they looked like they had this like kind of like orangish red like fluid on them. And they looked scorched. Well, they probably um, got burnt. But, but three, of them, three of them survived, but they haven't grown past a foot. They're still on the side. Oh, there's actually two left now. They were in that planter, and then the planter, like somebody, did somebody come over here and like like dig up the the trees because I had to replant them. No, I don't know. I got to cut this grass down. I'll do that in the morning when it's cool. Just cut out of hand. There's my little crane. What kind of grass is this? The cats always go for this grass. See my crane. Hey, what kind of what kind of grass is this? It's got like a this almost like a thistly kind of thing. Yeah, it's like a. It's just like a. Ornamental grass. Ornamental grass. Uh, I've got the name of it in the back somewhere. You used to grow stupid cat grass inside. Oh, yeah, wheatgrass? Yeah, I don't really, even really know what the actual plant was. Yeah, it's by cat grass. Yeah. I mean, it's by wheatgrass. Yeah, the cats love this this grass. They like this better than the wheatgrass. It must, cle it must cl but clear their like, systems it, out. This is rough. It hurts their stomach. Yeah, it's like pokey and fibrous. Yeah. Yeah. Very fibrous. Fucking celery on there. Might actually help their stomach. I gotta get these weeds picked up. Maybe tomorrow morning will be nice and cool. Yeah. I, I've got the bed up there, so at least if somebody needs to spend the night over. Yeah, it's like we got our guest room done like last year. And we're like, but she's like, nobody can come here. <laughs> uh, I have people coming after she leaves, and my like, people are coming. It's just like, not on here. I'm like, whatever. I've got. Antonio's niece and nephew are coming from Australia in November for, I don't know, maybe Australia. five to ten days they're going to stay. Why are they so, coming here? Because they want to see us. They, they want to see you? That's why they're coming here? The last time they were here was uh, 35 years ago. I don't know why they were coming here all of a sudden out of the blue. Not out of the blue. They wanted to travel. Yeah, kids are probably growing out. Well, like, like here's the thing. Well, okay, I, I have a question. Yeah, I, I have a question. And, and uh, okay, so Rena was 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 uh, in uh, New York recently, right? New York and Philadelphia. Okay, with Claudia, who's yeah. her daughter, right? Right. Why did 
Claudia go? She's younger than I am. Why would she go to Pittsburgh by herself if her and Rena were in New York? Like they went to go see the World Trade Centers, like where the World Trade Center buildings were. I don't know because she had some business to attend to. I mean, yeah, but she's from Australia, and she's gonna go to Pittsburgh by herself. She's a grown woman. And then Rena called the next day, and and it, she sounded like a different person. And she's like, like, hi, Uncle no Tony. Conspiracy. No, it's not. I'm just, I'm just saying because I saw her in, on camera. I was I like, hi. Her remember, voice. I was like, hi, Rena. You know who she looked like? She looked like Janine, a little bit. I never noticed that before. But not the. I didn't see her the second time she called. She sounded totally different. Yeah. That's all. That's I'm just told, saying. I told you a sister. Um, the old, she was the oldest. She went to Australia mm. because Antonio's mother was born here in uh, the 1800s and um, late 1800s. The father was a coal miner. The father had been here for five years and the mother got nervous because she had some kids in Italy and he wasn't going back. And she said, if I don't go back and get him, I don't think he's going to come back. So yeah. she went to Australia. I mean, she went to the United States to get her coal my husband to come back so I could, while she was waiting for him to finish up his work and stuff for five more years until his mother was born so yeah. all his brothers and sisters got to be United States citizens automatically you know because she went back to Italy when she was five years old gotcha, gotcha. except in 1945 they changed the law and Tony couldn't become a citizen something to do with the war ending the guys over there having kids or something I don't know yeah, what they yeah. did but they changed the law he could come here on a permanent green card sister, all the sister went to Australia in an arranged marriage, married a guy, and she was expecting all her brothers to come to Australia to, you know, stay with her, and none of them went right, to Australia. So. Yeah. But Antonio didn't get to see his sister for probably 30 years. Yeah. Yeah. And she came here. I'm going to go inside. Are you wrong? Uh, I'm going to roll on that. All right, Josh. I'll, I'll see you soon. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll call. I'll give you a call. Sounds good. All right, bye. Okay, go take a nap. Yeah, right. Go take a nap. I got it. Take a nap so you can murder me, motherfucker.